Hello everyone and welcome to Sheldon Cove's Farms here in Stardew Valley. My name is Melanie B. It is now Monday the 1st of summer and we have finally achieved the tiller title. So now we can unlock the UI Info Suite mod. Okay, let's get out of bed and we'll check the TV weather for tomorrow. It's going to be beautiful and sunny. And fortune teller for today. The spirits are very displeased. Really, spirits? Okay, let's head outside. Okay, so we've got a lot to do for today because it's planting day. So let's get a bit of this stuff cleared up. And I'm going to hoe up some spots and water the tiles. Okay, watering all done. Okay, so next I want to head down to Cinder Sap and do a little foraging before we head over to Pierre's. Welcome, we'll mark this off. So we need to find three different types of Forage. We need to find the grapes, the spicy berry, and the sweet pea. I think probably the spicy berry is the hardest to find. Well, I guess it depends. Sometimes it's it's the grape. <laughs> but I always have no problem finding sweet peas. Okay, no spicy berry here. It's getting pretty late. We got our hurry. <laughs> Come on. Oh, there's one. Finally. And we just need to find a grape. I know I can find a grape over by the bus stop. Because that's usually where I find the grape. And sometimes in the backwoods. And there's Elliot. Okay, let's head on over to Pierre for some seeds. Oh, and there is Jazz. Now, Jazz is one of the birthday people for summer, so we'll say hello to her. And we'll talk to Vincent as well. Hey, Granny Evelyn. And let's say hello to Jody and Caroline. So we can accept a quest. I could really go for a delicious hot pepper. Could a local farmer deliver one to me? Um, I'm not gonna have any hot peppers ready. So these are the birthday for this month. And three of these are for East Scarp. Okay, so I'll have to keep an eye on that. And with the UI Info Suite mod, we can also check that without even coming all the way down here. Okay, Pierre. Say hello to Leia. I'll talk to Pierre as well. Okay, I certainly hope I have enough money for all the seeds I want. I think I'll get about 32 melon. A tomato. Let's get five. Blueberries, we'll get 15. Peppers, 5. And wheat, we won't get wheat right now. Radishes, we'll get 5. 
and I want hops and some corn oh I don't have space okay gotta sell the daffodil I think I'll plant some extra hops I'll have to make some extra space <laughs> oh that's okay so let's head back to the farm and get this all planted hopefully we have enough I think we should okay perfect there is a grape over here so we have all we need for the bundles at the community center we'll have to come back and get this grape I guess or I'll just get rid of the clay okay there we go okay planting time Okay, everything is all watered and planted. Now let's see what we can take to the community center. Oh, I forgot I had some melon seeds here. Ah, okay. And we also have a star fruit. Let's actually plant this right now too. Okay, so we need to get some donations for the community center as well. But let me go ahead and get this star fruit over here it's gonna be one random <laughs> there we go hopefully the scarecrow can reach that one I think I might need another scarecrow okay what do we need fiber and coal 20 fiber do I have 20 fiber how do I not have any fiber? <laughs> uh, I don't really want to use the wood anyway. Because I need to deliver that to Robin today. So for the community center, we'll need the solar essence. And we'll need some quartz. Earth crystal. We'll need a copper. Gold. Oh, I need some iron smelted. Let's get that in there right now. We'll see if we need to take that or not today. We might take some more stuff tomorrow. Okay, what else do I need to take with me to the community center? Um, the bat wings. I think we need 10 of those. And we need fire quartz and we need a potato. Oh, we have a rare crow right here. Let's get this placed. Um, right there for now. Okay, fire quartz. I can donate that. Okay, what else do we need for the bundles? So this will complete the spring crops bundle. And then we can complete the summer forage. What about fish? Can we donate any of our fish? We can do catfish and shad. Um... Catfish, we got one catfish. Oh, we only have one shad though. Uh oh, we're not gonna be having enough for the the museum. Okay, we'll have to donate that later, I guess. Catfish and shad. I think I need a bream. Yep. Don't need that. Ah, uh, the eel. 
I think I want to save that eel to put into a fish pond. We'll donate that later, maybe. Uh, halibut, no. And, yeah, I think that's all we need to donate for now. Okay, let's head on over to the community center. Then we have to go up and see Robin as well to give her the wood. Hopefully we can get her while she's still outside. What time does Robin close up at 8? Maybe we'll have to go to Robin's first. Since she's going to be gone at 8 o'clock. Look at all of these sweet pea. No, I don't want to eat that. I'm out of space. Of course I am. <laughs> oh, I really would love some coffee. Okay, Robin, here's some wood. Oh, you got the wood. That's great. I'll tell Marlin, then start working on the guild. Okay, cool. So we need to enter the Adventures Guild after Robin finishes the expansion. And we also have 100 G's for completing our coop. Okay. And there's a wormy spot. Gotta get it. Just some clay. How disappointing. <laughs> okay, let's run back to the community center. We'll say hello to Maru and Demetrius. I think Demetrius' birthday is in the summer as well, so we'll have to be gifting him, but we have strawberries. So we can give that to Demetrius. And spring crops. We can finally complete it. Okay. And we got some fertilizer, which reminds me I did not fertilize my crops. I'll have to do that when I get back. Hopefully we don't spend too long in the mines. Okay, and we got our first bundle. And so we've locked, unlocked the bulletin board. Okay, forage. Some more forage. There we go. Oh, we're donating a silver quality sweet pea. Oh well, that's fine. And we got 30 summer seeds. Fantastic. Okay, let's go do a little fish and then we'll go down to the boiler room. So we have unlocked the vault now. Which I would like to get unlocked as soon as possible. Because I want to go to Skull Cavern. Okay, fish bundle. Do one catfish. And one shad. And specialty fish, we haven't caught any of these yet, but we should be able to catch a wood skip pretty soon. Tuna and the uh, red snapper and tilapia, we should be able to find them in the ocean. Don't have any of those. We got this guy. We'll get the eel in after we duplicate them. I find it's hard to catch eel. So now we'll be able to donate to this bundle. But let's donate what we have for the boiler room. So we will be able to unlock this pretty soon. We might come back tomorrow to do that. And... We'll do this. And that. And what do we get? A small magnet ring. 
Okay, and let's donate some for the geologist bundle. So we still are missing the frozen tier. But we'll go into the mines today. Maybe we'll get lucky with that. Okay. Let's head over to the mines. So I definitely want to go to level 40 and beyond. Just so I can find some some frozen tier. And actually, did I get down to level 50 last time? Yeah, anything over 50 should be good. Let's grab this grape. And I'll also put my magnet ring on. Might as well have a little extra magnetism. Okay, let's go into the mines and see how lucky we get. Do I have my sword? Oh, thank goodness. For a second there, I was worried. <laughs> Okay, I can't believe how unlucky we are. Level 54. And I didn't even find a frozen tier. Which really, really sucks. Because <laughs> then we could have unlocked the minecarts. Okay, are we going to make it back? And I didn't even get to fertilize anything. What do we need to make? This special fertilizer, pine tar and clam, definitely can't do that. But we can make some regular fertilizer. Okay. I'll get some of this stuff fertilized. So, melons, we want those fertilized. And um, sap. I don't know. We're pushing it pretty close. I suppose we can probably get some of this stuff fertilized tomorrow. Okay, we're passed out. We should have just head inside. Because now we're going to lose money for absolutely no reason. Okay, well, our steel pickaxe is ready today. Let's check the weather for tomorrow. It's going to be beautiful and sunny day tomorrow. Nice. What is... The spirits feel neutral today? Well, you know, the spirits were in a horrible mood last... Oh, Robin's here. Melody B, I was just about to knock. Okay. I just wanted to swing by and give you an update on the guild's expansion. Everything is going great. I should be finished by tomorrow. Wow, you are so fast, Robin. Oh, I also wanted to give you this. A thousand G. What for? Turns out that the materials I needed to import from Granpleton cost less than I expected. The wizard told me to give some of the remaining money to you as compensation for helping gather the wood. Aw, thanks wizard. Thanks Robin. Alright Melanie B, I better get back to work. Remember to swim by and check my new work tomorrow? Will do. Okay, so let's see how much we can get. <laughs> Fertilize. Must be added before planting. <laughs> okay. Well, some of them worked at least. 
Okay, we'll put the fertilizer away. Okay, so I want to make some... I don't have any more spicy berries. I want to make some of uh, the tea saplings. But I can't. Okay. I also want to go into the mines again. I would like to get that frozen tear. I wonder if we can get a frozen tear from this frozen geode if we go to Clint. Yeah, we have to go to Clint anyway. We might get lucky. Yeah, we should give that a try. Let's check the mail. And Harvey billed us 60 Gs. You know what? Whatever, Harvey. I'm sick of you and your billing. So greedy. I'll put this away. I don't need to keep the forage with me. So I want to go to Clint and pick up my axe. And then we can get into the secret woods. And maybe we can get to the community center if we get lucky and get a frozen geode. A frozen tear from one of these frozen geodes. Do I have any other geodes here that I can crack open? No. Okay, well, let's go ahead and get these crops watered and then we'll head over to Clint. Okay, crops are all watered. And I'm going to take some stuff to sell to Piers, maybe. Actually, no, we'll just ship it. Where's the crops? Okay, we'll ship potatoes. I'll ship 15 of those. And do we need anything from here? Should I sell this diamond to Clint or should I just hang on to it? Ah, maybe we'll just hang on to the diamond. Okay, so we don't have any more geodes we can take to Clint. Okay, let's put that away. I don't need to take this sap with me. I don't need to crystal the quartz either. Okay, so I need to donate these three, and possibly might get lucky with Quint. Okay. Let's head over to see Quint first. Uh, look at the time already. Watering is going to take forever. But thankfully we have unlocked the line sprinklers mod now. So once we are able to craft sprinklers, that will be super useful. There's Robin. Off to the gym. And we should of course collect the forage. But I think I need mostly spicy berries. Because I've seen quite a few sweet pea. And some grapes, but only one spicy berry so far. I'll grab our axe back. Thanks, Clint. I wish I can put my pickaxe in right now, but I don't have nearly enough money. Okay, Clint, give us a frozen tear. Pretty please. That is not a frozen tear. 
Nor is that, Clint. What didn't you understand? Okay, can we donate these at least? Nope. Okay, I can donate one of them. Might as well do that right now. Okay. I'll head out. Let's grab the trash. Nothing there. I'll say hello to Pam. I uh, might as well stop by the community center since I have these bars with me anyway. And I need to start getting some gifting done. We'll do that tomorrow. Today I want to get use of my axe. Okay, copper, iron, and gold. Uh, what did we get? A furnace. Nice. Okay, so all we need is that frozen geode now. And we'll get it soon enough, I suppose. Okay, let's head on down to the secret foot. Okay, let's head on over. And use our beautiful new steel axe. And log be gone. Okay, got a bunch of hardwood. Now we have to watch out for these slimes in here. But now we can collect a bunch of hardwood. I'll also take those hardwood seeds, those mahogany seeds. Oh, let's switch some stuff up. I don't know why I brought my watering can or my hope. I guess I can use the hoe, but the watering can is completely unnecessary. Okay, more hot wood. Okay, we can grab this forage. Now I can do some fishing in here for the wood scab, but I want to go and check out the deep wood. Oh, holy, this is way different than it used to be. What is all this? What do these things do? You feel drawn towards this stone, you do not know why, do you dare touch it? I can say yes, eh, better not. Um, I'm gonna say you better not, because I have no idea where that leads. What is this house? What? This is very new, very different. Okay, lots and lots of things. I can search through stuff, never mind. Let's search through. You found nothing immediately useful, maybe another time. Okay, so I guess I'll have to come back here. What is this? Is this some sort of cage? Whoa, this is very interesting. Well, I guess this is kind of a work in progress and you're gonna need to update this eventually, but that's pretty cool. What does this sign say? You are entering the deep woods. Don't venture too deep if you aren't prepared. Many before you have gotten lost or worse. You have been warned. Okay, so I'll just go over one map, and yeah, there's a lot of trees in here, and I can see there's a lot of mushrooms as well, 
let's collect some of those actually if I can get past that is it's very hard to see what's going on in here there's just so many trees let's grab this mushroom I definitely don't want to go deep in here though yeah let's grab up all these chanterelles oh there's a bee in here gotta get out of here I want no part of any bees or any slimes or anything else for that matter okay let's go <laughs> okay we didn't get lost okay I'm heading back up to the secret woods there seems to be two uh, some fruit trees in there as well okay let's get rid of the slime get out of here slime so we might as well start stockpiling hardwood and I'm gonna go ahead and plant uh, these mahogany seeds I got Now, there should be some extra areas on our farm as well. Let's check these two off the list. Okay, let's go clear the logs on the farm. So, there's one over here. Okay, so it just looks like a little pool. Does it refill our energy? Ah, yes it does. Okay. That's good to know. So if we need our energy refill during the day, we can come down here. What else is there? There's one more over there. Oh, there's a crate over here. There is a bunch of wood, though. <laughs> Definitely need to clear up some of this debris. Okay, got some geode. Wish I'd gotten that before I went to Clint. Okay, and there should be another big log over on this side. I'll get that out of the way. Okay, there's another crate. More geodes, seriously? <laughs> okay, let's see what we got down here. Oh, we cow, what is this? Ah, uh, this is a massive tree felt area. I can't even see a thing. Oh my gosh, there's so many trees. Okay, we'll have to maybe come back tomorrow to see what's going on down here. Let's see if we can get some more wood though. I can't tell what's a tree and what's not a tree right now. <laughs> I kind of wanted to go to the mines to get some, get a chance at those frozen geodes. But by the time I get over there, it's going to be pretty late, so that's going to be pointless. Let's have some energy refill. Okay, let's get another tree down. There's just stones and rocks and trees everywhere. I wonder if I can plant things down here. Maybe it's an extra planting area. That would be super nice if it is. Okay, 
Okay, let's use up the last bit of our energy. Okay. And we already explored this area up here. Okay, let's head back up. Um, do I have enough weed to get any tea saplings? Okay, oh, yep, yeah, we can craft some tea saplings. We can do three right now. So we are just short on the fiber. Okay, we'll cast this aside for now. And we'll solve that. We'll solve this. We sell this and this, and I don't need this soap zone, so I might as well sell that. Now I need to plant these mahogany seeds. I don't know where's a good planting area though. Okay, I guess just where we just planted them is a good one. And we'll head to bed. Well, we made 3,100 Gs for today. Not bad. Well, that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.